y por la lucha de armas, en la búsqueda de los sistemas filipinos, los sistemas japoneses de lucha, incluso los europeos. Y me planteé la necesidad, o quizás una, un punto importante, que era tener en Taos Academy un departamento de armas. Y comencé a mirar un poco lo que había en el panorama, habiendo excelentes maestros, a los cuales reconozco con gran, con, con gran respeto. Siempre recordé una conversación que tuve con mi maestro, con Sifu Víctor Gutiérrez, en la cual siempre me hablaba excelentemente bien de, de, de un maestro inglés llamado Steve Tapping, al cual se refería siempre con mucho cariño y con mucho respeto, tanto a nivel personal como a nivel como maestro, a nivel profesional. Y bueno, pues contacté con él. Uh, one of the last people that I agreed to work with was actually in Spain. Um, prior to that, I did make a, a conscious decision that I wasn't going to work with anyone else. But I'd been to Spain a lot for, for about 10 years and did three week tours and did Budo Ganas. And I liked working in Spain and I liked the, the, the way people work now. But the email I got was completely different to what everybody else sends me. It basically was come and show us what you do, we're open-minded, you can teach what you want, and let's have a look. And um, when I asked the background, I knew who his teachers were, and Salvador said nothing but good things about everybody he'd worked with, and that shows a good character. And he was willing to let me run loose in his organisation, which can be dangerous for people. But we met. And I remember his first words to me on, on the aeroplane, uh, when I got off the aeroplane uh, driving to the hotel, he said, tomorrow um, is a busy day for families and you might not have so many people there. And I realized that in the past they've been bored or, or they've not been happy and they're just coming for one session to please Salvador. So his students wasn't convinced. So we had a really good time on, on our first session and, and what I did is I said to his students, just attack my guys, how you want, any way you want, just to prove to them that we can do what we say. And from the following day, we had even more people turned up and that's how our relationship started. And since then, Wayne, or my son, who's been doing this since he, he could walk as well, uh, we've been coming two or three times a year, every year since we've met. And we've got a lot of things for the future because he's developing in Spain a student instructor base. So he's got a lot of instructors that are showing interest now, not because he wants them to, but because they see that there's something in it. So if we reach some of his instructors, then all the students are going to be looked after. And that leads all sorts of um, good things for the future.